Oh no, let's go over there. And welcome back to some more Dark Eye Chains of Sentinel. So, we're here, we're gonna catch the last two couple of crows. We're gonna put this chandelier in the fireplace. And then we're gonna put the net all over here. Like that. I'm not sure if My should I should Okay, maybe I should use the cane. I'm supposed to catch them. Oh my god, then how the hell am I supposed to scare him? I'm supposed to cut. Okay, how do how do you scare? How do you I'm out of ideas. Oh, how do you scare the crows? Let's see. Mm. Let's see. Do you want? <laughs> can I? Th I can th do better than that. Okay, so what? It isn't Wait, gonna. No, no. I, I wanna deselect. There we go. I've caught the first bugger. Regrettably, that was the only bait I had. No more bait. Put it here. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh snap! Oh shit! The crow's attacking me. It was kind of like anticlimactic. Just. I want some more dramatic music. Oh shit! What is this? Oh, it's the old seer that they burned. You. You spell doom. Oh. Just <laughs> as I thought. Okay. What? Where am I? The execution. The seer. Silence. No bad omens. And to think I put in a good word to the king for you. Dude, I just caught two crows. What happened? I know what will happen. You'll catch those crows by the hour of six this evening, or you'll be put in the pillory. The crows. Right. I don't suppose this was successful. The sand in your hourglass is wasting away, bird catcher. It will run out at the hour of six this evening. This dream, it... Uh... <laughs> Pull yourself together, Geron, and start to deal with those crows already. The okay. king trusts me. I can't let him down. Perhaps Gwynling found something that can help me while he was dissecting the bird. But... I caught, like, two out of three b birds. This should be good enough, right? Damn these... spoiled brats. Geron, yeah. you turned up at the right time. He sure seems to have gone through a mood change. That can't be good. You'll have to catch a fairy for me. As quickly as possible. A fairy? A fairy? What's gotten into you? We don't have much time. Help me. Oh shit, there's some serious business. Why a fairy? What do you need a fairy for? Is she supposed to drive away the crows for you? I may be wrong. But perhaps the seer is back. Oh Again shit. Again with this horror story. Guess You're who's not back? not making any sense. You'd better help me expel the crows from the royal guest chambers. Later. For now, just do what I tell you. Return of Seer. How could the Seer possibly be back? He's dead, isn't he? We all watched him die. But now, not only the crows have returned. But the magpies too. Murders, Geron. Where none should occur. First Knight Alderich, now Magister Dorata. They were the ones who put the Seer at the stake. Oh, who shit. knows what else will happen. Let's see. How do you know so much about the seer? It was I who led all those heroes to him. To his hideout in the Stone Oak Forest. Oh, shit. You were part of the hero's quest? Hunters and scouts. We caught him. And then we burnt him. And now a knight and a magician are dead. Just trust me. And all will be fine. Oh my god, don't quit kill Quinling. What's a fairy got to do with the seer? Not a fairy, the fairy. You have to catch her before someone else does. What does the seer want with the fairy? Only she can unleash the power of the magic harp. No man, not even the seer, can play it without dying. By the gods. If he's back, everything will start all over. You aren't making any sense to me, old man. Shit. So much, so many things here. 
Tell me more about that magic harp. I don't know. It's said to be from the realm of the fairies. Okay. Is this the one in the drawing? This is what she might look like. Who can be sure? What did the seer want with the harp? He longed for her, because she was the gateway to his power. Or oh, that's what he thought, anyway. What powers does the harp hold? Nobody knows. But it is said that when the harp sounds, Andergast will perish. That's why you have to catch the fairy. She is the key. I'm going to use the fairy and play the damn harp so all of you die in this fucking town. Why haven't you told me all this before? Now is not the time. Well, obviously, it never was the time. Let's see, remedy for crows. How did you catch that crow over there? A certain attractant, but it needs water that's been touched by fairy magic. So I would have to go where the fairy lives anyway. That's Sweet. right. How convenient. <laughs> if I catch the fairy, will you help me with the king's crows? Promise. But would you please hurry now? You don't have to tell me that. Why can't he catch by himself? All right. How do I catch a fairy? The fairy lives in a hidden place in the stone oak forest, near an old but sealed fairy portal. Look about two midden miles north of the old finger where the one berries grow. If you hear the great waterfall, you're in the right place. Oh, I'll find that place all right. Try to lure the fairy out of her hollow by playing your flute. She's nosy, but also very shy. And then I'll catch her with a cage. Fairies can be deceiving. Don't let her put a spell on you. Not to worry. If she's got wings, I'll catch her. Sweet. And with this fairy water, I'll be able to catch my crows? Yes. All the other ingredients are easy to find. Splendid. The king will be amazed. I'm on my way now. You mustn't fail. I shan't. I shan't. Can, can I break this? I swear I'll never break one of Gwynling's inch. I can still feel the spanking to this day. Oh my god. You, you let yourself get spanked, dude. Alright, let's go to the forest. Oh, I almost forgot the cage. Oh, yeah, I did. Thank you, B G Garon, for reminding me. Let's see. Cage? Is the cage fixed yet? Yes. And take better care of it next time. How big is this fairy? Is this really enough? Whatever. Let's go, let's go. Alright, let's look for the one berries. And the waterfall. Okay, we guess we're here. I didn't really have to do anything. No looking around. Very well then. Right. Okay, I don't even have to select the flute. <laughs> Hello there. Oh, I'm so sorry. What? Nothing. You're doing all right. Just keep practicing. I'm not even here. You're all alone in the woods and nobody's here to judge you. Not even me. See how I'm born? That must be her. Stop. Wait. Bling. Lure some more. I've got a beautiful melody for you. Listen to this. Just keep on playing. Will you come out of there? Who? Why, you, of course. Who, me? Have you forgotten you're all alone? <sighs> I'm not alone. You are here. And who else? Nobody. Aha. Uh -huh. If you were a friend of the forest, they'd all be here. The moss hogs and the hazel ferrets. The pebble crane would even rain on you from the skies to honor you. And the wood foxes would build a magnificent bonfire and everyone would dance. What? But as you are not a friend of the forest, everyone just stayed at home. What the hell? You, she just said that a bird would crap on my head to prove that I'm a friend. If I were a friend of the forest, would you come out then? Yes, in that case we'd have something to talk about. We'd have to stand in awkward silence otherwise. And in order to be a friend of the forest, I'd have to... Have friends, that's right. Resin rats, for example. Or paper finches. And where would I find those? If you don't have any friends, you have to make them up. What on earth has Gwynling foisted upon me? <laughs> Alright. I'll be back in a minute. Let's see. I have to go around in the forest. Do I take up the cage? 
Alright, let's see. I can go down there. Pile of leaves. Is there something in here? Or oh, there's something there. What's hidden in the foliage there? What's hidden in Guess I'll have to dig in the foliage then. Yes, do it. Ow! No fairy. Just a hedgehog. Okay, do we capture the hedgehog? The hedgehog scurried away. Uh, do I put it... He won't eat those. Okay, what will he eat then? What f cat? Do I pick this up? Wait, what is this? A snail. Can I take that? Joink. Let's see, tree hollow. I can't go up there. Let's see, what? No, please stay. I seldom have visitors. All oh, right. But, oh my god. She wants the tea. Tree hollow, pile of leaves. Okay, so what do I do in order to get this damn... Let's see. Do they do they eat snails? I don't know what hedgehogs hedgehogs eat. Oh, dude, it's horrible. Very well. Perhaps what? Gwynling will settle for a hedgehog in case I can't catch the fairy. <laughs> why can't why can't he use like this snail as a forest friend? Serves you right, spiky guy. You shouldn't always sting our guests. No wonder no one ever comes to visit us. K wait. Nothing. What what am I supposed to do with hedgehog spikes? Okay, what uh, what do I what do I do with this? Uh oh wait, what? Chest note twigs. Help yourself. I have plenty of those. Chestnuts. Do I You're the fairy out of a hollow playing the flute. Great idea, Gwynling. All right. This one goes here. That one there. Oh, it's it's a building. This one over there. <laughs> oh my god. I remember doing Chestnut this. Mannequin. When I was a little little boy. Hello. Hello. Okay, mannequin. Well, now, a chestnut king. A king? Really? Yeah, he rules the realm of the chestnuts and, uh, and <laughs> he's my friend. I'm deeply honored, your tiny majesty. Here on here is my dearest friend of the forest, my lady fairy. <laughs> Both of you may enter. Oh. Let's go inside. Such a metaphor, just opening her tree hollow for me. Oh, is this the water? What, what a I strange need? place! And uh, what is this place? Like an egg and Dolls stuff. Dolls made of bulbs with hats made of leaves. Hmm. But where is the? Hello. I am oh. Nuri Dari Nelavanda, and what? this is Miss Greenbald, Finkel and Hinkle, the Turnip Ghosts. And plapper up. I'm not gonna uh, even try to uh, s say her name again. Why are you looking name. at me like that? Are you in love? Now that's unfortunate. <laughs> what? I thought you were a fairy. All this nonsense completely in vain. Of course I am a fairy. What else could I be? You're a human, just like I am. You're much too tall for a blossom fairy and a man sized fairy? We'll turn you into a radish at once if you don't keep quiet. Oh no, the dolls, they, no, please, please don't do it. I'm just a simple bird catcher, how was I supposed to know? Oh, shit. I'm just fooling around. I can't turn anyone into a radish. In fact, I can't turn anyone into anything anymore. But you are a fairy? Yes, why? Ask to come, urge, ask, ask. Would you like to come with me? Why? Do you want to show me your world, which must be full of humans? Uh, yes. With roofs made from wooden shingles. I want to show you. Uh, exactly. I can show human. you those. Oh, that's marvelous! But no, I can't leave here. I must stay near the fairy gate. The fairy gate? What? What keeps you here? Why can't you just come with me? If I leave here, 
I get sick. The only thing that keeps me alive in this world is the magic of the fairy gate. How's that? It is my well. Without its water, my soul dries up. Like a plant. Okay. Yeah, take it along, dude. Couldn't you just take a part of the magic with you? How could I do that? Hmm. Let me think about it. Right, fairy gate, fairy land. Did you come from the fairy land? Yes. And hopefully I'll never go back there. Why don't you want to go back to your home? That's just the way it is. Well, all right. To each their own secrets. Fairy gate? Is this the fairy gate? Does it lead to your world? Not anymore. It's been sealed. Oh no. All right, I'll be back in a minute. All right, so I need to store this in something. Can I, let's see. Wait, wait, let's see. Fairy gate, wait, is that? I'm looking for something to, oh, leather ribbons. Can I borrow one of these ribbons? Not those, I wanted to use them to. No, I can't remember what I wanted with them. Oh shit. She I'll has Alzheimer's. Them to you as a present. Okay, thank you. Let's see, what do I have here? Just not a mannequin, leather ribbons, flute, hammer. I don't see anything else I can pick up. Alright, let's see what happens if I pre uh, I'm not gonna climb up there. All kinds of things could happen if I touch this gate. Oh, okay. See, should I leave or should I? I don't know if I should find something here. Or if I have to go back to town and maybe get something to carry the um, her magic in. Let's see if we can have talk to her. Have you seen my waterfall yet? It keeps flowing downwards, even at night. I'll be back in a minute. I'll be back in a minute, yo. Right, so I have to find something to carry this, carry the water in. Let's see. So I'm gonna be right back and go search and see if I find something. Get out of there. Oh, let him out. That's nice of you. Oh, can I? Oh, the snell. Oh. Oh. Yeah, baby boy. Yo, dude. Get a fucking snell shell. Snakes. What? What? Snail shell. The snail shell would make a good vessel. If the water in this well is magical, Nuri can carry it in the shell. But I can't reach it without touching the magic gate. Okay, can we ask her to do it? I think she'd better not know of the snail yet. Uh, okay, ribbon. Let's see where this leads me. And you go in here. The snail shell. If the war, but I can't. Okay. Uh, with the cane. Well, the prawn shellers of Nostria would laugh at me. Fishing rod. Sweet. What are you doing there? I'm an engineer. Be impressed. Very well. But how do I seal the snail shell now? Fisherman, sweet. Okay, I'm a fisherman. How do I seal this with a uh, this? Interesting. Boink. The acorn fits on the end of the snail shell like a cork. Sweet. Now I'm a finally, puzzle master mind. the leather ribbon so that the fairy won't spill anything. Sweet. Here you go. Nary. Here we go. Look what I've made for you. You've tied Yerk of the snail to a leather ribbon. No, look. The snail shell is filled with water from the fairy gate. Now you can come with me. Really? Just try it. Woo! All righty. Let's go. Let's go home to my world. Let's see. Oh, we're on a we mess to get away. Everything. Where do we go first? We have to go to Andergast. <laughs> to my crib. Is that where you live? That's one way of expressing it. Which way? This way. Wait. I have to show you off to my friends. Yo, I'm not gay. Look, Geron. A magnificent bird. This plague gets worse and worse. Come. There's the town gate. I just want to say hello to him. This unkempt black witch's beast? 
says the ugly, pale-faced pig-eater. Hello, Raven. I oh. advise you to avoid the town. What's he saying? Two dark figures tiptoe past the gate. They're on the lookout for your fairy friend. Who says she's a fairy? I am a fairy. She's lying. How come you can talk anyway? And how do you know everything? I once made a big mistake. Big so mistake. the gods punished me by giving me the conscience of a man. Birds don't make mistakes. Birds just do whatever it is that birds do. <laughs> you mean like the crows in this town? Why don't you regale us with a cheerful tale? Stay away from him, Nuri. Something's wrong here. But all creatures have the gift of speech, Garon. That's not important. Come on. You'll be safe with me and Gwynling. Let him talk, dude. <gasps> Blood! Why is the door open? This is where you live? Something's wrong here. Look at this mess. Is this blood? By the gods, there's somebody here. The fairy. I have to hide her. In the fucking... Here! Go! Closet! Look, Nuri, this is exciting. Is that a cave? Yes, wait in there until you see a bright light. Who's this? Hello. I am Nuri Dari Nelavanda, but Geron calls me Nuri. <sighs> I have to find out what's going on here. Yes, 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 go up. Dude! Uh, no! Uh, uh, <laughs> Quinling! By the gods. What happened here? Such dramatic music. Your eyes. Who did this to you? Oh shit! The... Yeah. Oh my He's god! Back. Don't move. I'm with you now. He sent his creatures for me. The fairy. You'll have to. They. Quinling, no. Quinling. Quinling, stay with me. <coughs> Wait, did the crows take the window? Uh, I mean, the door instead of the window. And I mean, why? Is the blood downstairs? I don't know. Attackers. What did the attackers want from you? The old fairy. Scholar. He'll be the next. What do they want with the fairy? He needs her, but he mustn't. Yeah, get I already her. know that, dude. What kind of creatures were they? Creatures of the night. What? Strangers in a strange world. What did they look like? They had pale faces and pointy claws. Okay, so they weren't crows. What fairy scholar? <laughs> Please don't die. Not now. No, I, I have one more quick, with question. Us back then, thirteen years ago, he, he was the one who sealed the gate to the fairy land. Where is he now? It was all in vain. Yeah, shut up, tell Where me is the fairy scholar? In the blood barrier at the Red Lake. He went to the Orkland. Orkland. To let now all is lost. What did you tell them? I spit at them. With my own blood. You go, Quinling. Thank you. What will happen with the fairy now? There's only one solution. What way is that? You'll have to kill her. What the it's fuck, the dude? only way the seer can be stopped. What? No, I'm not a murderer. In that case, Andergast will perish. I mean, who cares about Andergast, right? <laughs> All right. All right. You'll just perish. All right. I can't kill the fairy. You'll have to do it. Surely there must be another way. Don't be a fool. His power is beyond the realm of your imagination. Gwynling? There. I can hear them. The black wings. Uh. No, 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 What Quinling. am I going to do now? What am I going to do? I can't kill the fairy. I'm not going to change my mind again. There must be another way. The fairy scholar, 
The Red Lake in the Blood Barrier. The King can deploy his knights there. They'll know how to defeat the Seer. I must go to the castle immediately to warn them and everything will be fine. <laughs> everything will be is. fine? There's the witch! Wait, what? Don't look into her eyes! Witch! Take her to the stake to burn! Don't tell me they f found her. Oh no. Nuri! Oh shit. Oh my god, Nuri, you stupid bitch! Well, alright, I'm gonna end this episode right here. Stupid mob. We'll have to. F oh my god. So, yeah, I'm thank you guys for watching. Gracias por ver. We shall find this name of dudes. Until next time. Hasta luego.